A very good morning to you all children. Hope you all are fine and are having fun. Today we are going to learn something very interesting and with lot of fun in this session of science. Because children, it is believed that whatever we see happening around us is because of science. The answer of each and every question about all the phenomena, जो कुछ भी हमारे चारों तरफ हो रहा है, हर उस चीज का reason कैसा क्यों हो रहा है किस लिए हो रहा है ये ऐसा माना जाता है कि हर क्वेश्चन का आंसर साइंस में छुपा हुआ है और साइंस हम बेसिकली पढ़ते क्यों हैं अपने खुद के बारे में जानने के लिए राइट चिल्ड्रन और इन अस द बेसिक थिंग इज आवर हेल्थ इफ यू आर हेल्दी देन ओनली वी विल बी एबल टू स्टडी द फॉर हेल्थ children what is the most important thing it is the good food right the chapter 1 of your book deals with that only so we begin with chapter 1 which is food and digestion in this chapter children we will be studying few things which are see they are all here food about food nutrients of food balanced diet digestion of food and cooking of food right they are all are very important because we cannot eat an uncooked food right also children there are some words which are very essential see we are here word you know on world health the first word is nutrient nutrients are essential substances present in food they are those substances which are useful for our body and are present in our food right a good mixture of these nutrients makes a food healthy second word is digestion it is the process of breaking food into simple substances now what we eat children is roti then dal then vegetables fruits but our body recognize doesn't recognizes this what our body recognizes is carbohydrate fats proteins now breaking down of what we eat like roti rice and then vegetables fruits into carbohydrates fats and proteins is what we call as digestion right next word is roughage roughage are the fibers present in food that help us to eliminate waste from the body right we will be discussing about it later on and last but not the least is deficiency that means lack ya kami kisi cheez ki like sometimes when we eat food we eat a lot of food but even then we don't feel energetic hame lagta hai ki nahi energy khana khub khaya magar energy nahi lagti to kuch to kami hai na wo jo kami hoti hai usi ko hum deficiency kehte hain right children so now we move ahead in this chapter as we begin with food right so pay attention as this is a very very important chapter for all of us now firstly we should know what is food all living things need food food helps to grow and to stay alive it gives energy to work and keeps fit and healthy that means har living thing ko jo log jo bhi cheeze zinda hai like us animals plants insects we all need food right this food helps us to grow and stay alive ye food agar hame nahi mile to na hum grow kar sakte hain na hi hum zinda reh sakte hain just imagine children for one day agar aapko khana na mile kuch bhi na mile na khana na nashta aapka kya hal hoga bahut bura hal hoga na you cannot stay fit Rather, कुछ लोग तो मर भी जाएंगे है ना तो दैट इज द इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ फूड इट हेल्प टू ग्रो एंड स्टे लाइफ इट गिवस एनर्जी टू वर्क एंड कीप्स फिट 
एंड हेल्दी ये हमको कोई भी काम करने की शक्ति देती है देता है और हमको फिट एंड हेल्दी रखता है इट हेल्प्स इट आल्सो प्रोटेक्ट्स फ्रॉम डिजीजेस राइट चिल्ड्रन अगर अच्छा फूड हमने खाया है तो हमको डिजीजेस होने के चांसेस कम होते हैं आप देखिए जो लोग हेल्दी होते हैं जिनके सिक्स पैक वगैरह होते हैं वो जल्दी बीमार नहीं पड़ते और आप ही के जो फ्रेंड्स जो दुबले पतले होते हैं वो अक्सर आपको क्लास में छींकते हुए खांसते हुए या छुट्टी पे मिलते होंगे सही कह रहा हूँ ना मैं ना सो so, अभी तक हमने फूड के क्या क्या यूजेस पढ़े सबसे पहला यूज इट हेल्प्स अस टू ग्रो सेकेंड टू स्टे लाइफ थर्ड इट गिव्स गिव्स एनर्जी टू वर्क फोर्थ keeps us fit and healthy fifth protects from diseases right so these are the five main functions of food now children we get our food from animals and plants you all know from animals we get egg milk meat and from plants we get fruits vegetables then rice and all that now there is this is look at the picture and write p for food items that we get from plants and a for food items that we get from animals now i'll be marking only one one rest i leave it for you right just imagine the picture on the top this orange orange stuff right these are eggs eggs we get from animals so i will write a here now see this this is rice rice we get from plants now rest you all have to think and mark on your own okay as i proceed further now i begin with nutrient of food now all food items contain different useful elements these elements are called nutrients remember so these are there are three key words in this entire definition which are different useful elements they are useful and these elements are called nutrients the food we eat is divided into three major groups energy giving body building and protective right so what are these three major groups energy giving body building and protective food now five food contains five main group of nutrients there are five main groups of nutrients which are there in our food please remember there are five main groups of nutrients in this chapter there will be some more also but they are not main they are nutrients but they are not main right and these five groups are right first is carbohydrate then protein then fats vitamins and minerals right children what are they carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins and minerals is it clear about each of these i will be telling you all in my next lecture whenever i meet you all is it okay to you till now you are clear so now let let's have a quick recap of what all we studied today right firstly what we studied is about food that what is food now what is food what are the functions of food it helps us to grow to stay alive it gives energy to work keeps us fit and healthy it also protects us from diseases right okay and then we went to nutrients that nutrients are essential food elements which are there and these elements are useful for us and then we studied 
the five basic nutrients which are carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins and minerals right children so you just need to read up till now, up till here and then you have to complete this picture which is there on page number 5 right children so i hope you liked this uh, session of science and till now uh, we meet again uh, continue reading this chapter and try to learn those four terms which are given on the top nutrient their meaning digestion roughage and deficiency okay so thank you very much and have a great day